<laughs> if you're looking for a good laugh, you might want to make your way to Appleton. Starting tonight, comedian John Reap will take the stage at the Skyline Comedy Cafe. You might know him as the winner of the last comic standing. Or remember those great commercials, the Hemi guy? Yeah, he's the Hemi guy. See? This guy right here. Get a should I up. do it? You yeah. to, should Go I ahead, do the do whole it. line? Yeah, would you? I actually did six commercials for those guys. Uh -huh. And this is all six of them real fast, back to back. <laughs> and I'll do it to that camera right okay. there. You ready? Yeah. Here we go. <clears throat> hey, that thing got a hemi. <laughs> you about to find out. Come on, man, floor it. Give me closer. I smell a hemi. That can't be good. Sweet. That's all six. And you made some money from that, right? I did. <laughs> yeah, got me a house. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because they, they ran a little bit longer than they were supposed to, didn't yeah, they? Yeah, well, we were... <laughs> It's been a while, but when we did the first one, I didn't know there'd be a second. Right. And he ended up doing six. Wow. So they kept calling me back. Um, and it was, Dodge was good to me, man. They paid me to go to the Daytona 500 three years in a row. They paid me to go to car shows. Cool. Where I, I was a celebrity judge <laughs> of a burnout contest. That's when I realized there is a God. <laughs> it was the greatest thing ever. But what, what I like to do uh, most, because I rent cars all the time. You know, I drive mm -hmm. around right. in a rental car. And every now and then, this moment will happen where I'm sitting at a stoplight in a rental car, yeah. right? And sure enough, a guy right next to me pulls up in a Dodge Ram truck with a Hemi engine in it. Yeah. And, you know, and I'm just sitting there. I look over. I'm like, oh, <laughs> I got to do it, right? Yeah, have you done it before? Oh, yeah. Really? I roll the window down and go, hey, you got a Hemi? <laughs> and the people will look over. And the people who drive those trucks, they know those yeah. commercials, right? And they'll look over and go, ha, ha. That guy's doing that. That's him! Like that. And then I floor it, and I win in a Dodge Neon, or whatever was cheaper that day. Sometimes it's a Kia. You sound like you're not from around these parts. No. Where, where are you from, John? I, uh, uh, I'm originally from a little town in North Carolina called Hickory. Uh -huh. are, are, you, are you familiar with uh, Hickory? Not really, no. Well, we were once the furniture capital of the world, oh, okay. home to Winston Cup champion Dale Jarrett, mm -hmm. and the pig from Green Acres. Really? Yes. Wow. A lot the of people pig don't know from Green yeah. Acres. Yeah. That's Remember great. Remember his name? Uh, uh, Arnold. Nope. Ava Gabor. Actually <laughs> from Hickory. A lot of people don't know that about her. <laughs> then she moved to Hungary. Just kidding. Uh, <laughs> Hickory sits at the bottom of the Appalachian Mountains, so literally even hillbillies are looking down on it. <laughs> Look at them down there brushing their tooth, acting all uppity. But it's not bad. I miss it. I live in L.A. now. Yeah, you're like you know, a celebrity because you've got a DVD out now. Well, I don't know if that makes you a celebrity, <laughs> but yeah, I do have a DVD. I mean, what is it? It's Metro Jethro? What's Met that yes, all about? Yes, perfect. You said it exactly right. It's hard to say it's Metro a, Jethro. It's a hard title. Yeah. My mom messes it up all the time. Yeah. She says, what is Metro Jethro? <laughs> no, no, it's not Metro. That's, that's in Palmdale, California. Okay. Uh, Metro Jethro is the name of my DVD. It's also a Comedy Central one-hour special. Uh, it just describes what I am. You know, I was born and raised in a small town. But now I've been working and living in Los Angeles for the last 10 years. So I've seen both sides of the, of the fence, mm -hmm. you know, so to speak. Mm -hmm. So I, I, I'm not a redneck. I'm not, I'm not like a ho Hollywood either. Mm -hmm. I'm a Metro Jethro. Oh, I see. Yeah, it's anybody who's from a small town but now lives in a big city. Or vice versa, you know. It's like we're not stupid rednecks. We're well rednecks, you know, have an education. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Uh, and you've been in movies, too. You were in the, the follow-up to... Uh... Did you see it? I did not. Harold, you got to see it. Is it good? Oh, it's great. Really? It's Well, Harold and Kumar escape from Guantanamo Bay. I play a redneck. Really? Can you believe that? I, that's a stretch. I swear. Yeah. yeah. It was rough. Yeah. I had a little longer hair, uh, and I sit around. I play this farmer who is uh, who grows weed on his farm, and uh, I have a cyclops for a son who lives in the basement. <laughs> And, and I'm married to my sister. Oh, so, there you again, go. not a stretch. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> He's a very funny guy. Obviously, John Reap is his name, and you can see him at Skyline Comedy Cafe tonight through Saturday. Did you know they got your book through Saturday, though? Did yeah, you know, John? yeah, yeah. And, and how, do you like the, night, how do you like the snow? I love the snow. All right. I haven't seen it in a while. We don't get snow in L.A. It, it'll be fine tonight for travel conditions if you want to go down there. 8 and 10.15 for the Times. Or get more information from fox11online.com. Go to Good Day Wisconsin. Thanks, John. Thank you. We'll be right back. You're watching Good Day, Wisconsin.